We are back! Guess what? We're back in Yu Yu. And you know what we're playing again? We're playing the funny the Titan and Ninetales combo. But yeah, make sure you like and subscribe for more content like this. And as you see right here, we do have the we have Salamence might be intimidate defensive. We might have Tyranitar to go competition wise. Let's go Hydreigon with Scarf and see if we can try to do something with this. And Volcanon. Really nice. Let's go Draco. You have no potential switch-ins on the Draco. So this is really good. The only one I can see tries to tank it is Tyranitar. And if they go for Tyranitar, I can go to Ninetales. So this is really, really good. Go to Mammoth Swine. Sash. I knew it was going to do that. You know what? Hmm. The only thing you could do potential damage wise is probably hurt, you know, Hydreigon with an ice move. Let's go Ninetales. Let's see from there. And Ice Shard, like I thought. So let's go for a freeze dry before anything worse happens. Kill off the Mammoth Swine. More likely they'll go Crawdont. If not, they're probably going to go Tyranitar. And Tyranitar, I don't know the what the Tyranitar has in the meta. Okay, never mind. Moot point. They brought in Volcanion, which I think is probably a bad move. Since I could set, easily set up Aurora Veil. And then go for a freeze draw and go for a neutral hit and potentially freeze. But that's just me. But now I'll bring in this Titan. Let's see if the main thumbnail mod can definitely do something. Okay, so you have this. Belly Drum. Let's see, let's see. And we get the Citrus Berry. And Flame... No! You are you are you serious? You really trying this? We kill off the Volcanion. Let's see how much more damage you could potentially do. Let's see. But, oh, uh, I think they could try to go with Tyranitar, but I am faster than most of their team rather than an Aqua Jet. Or Okay. You're just bringing out a Okay. Okay. Nice one. Unfortunately, that's going to be outclassed by... Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, shoot. All right. And oh, my God. We got a forfeit. Hey, yo. Yeah. So this this is like... This is a potential setup. But so Titan is... Pretty, it is an NUBL. And look at this. It just cleaned up a game from there. Oh, Lord. We got the Zoomeril. This seems to be like a funny team. Mainly a good UU team. But, uh... Let's go for hmm. Let's go for Hydreigon. Let's see if we can try to start off that as a lead. And they, they try to go for the sweep. No, they go Tinkaton. Hmm. Let's go U-turn. More likely they'll probably go for a Stealth Rock. We're willing to take that bet. Draw offensive Tinkaton. I'm not surprised, but I don't think you're going to be. You probably are going to be defensive. Defensive rocks with Thunder Wave or whatever. So I'm going to go U-turn. I'm going to go Tread just in case if you want to go for that. Play rough. Okay. So you're trying to go for the offensive. I'm going to go Self Rock. You're probably going to Self Rock. Yep. I'm going to Earthquake so you can get some damage off. You're... No. Okay. And you're probably going to go Sinish Shot for the potential damage. I got a better idea. Let's go to Masquerada just in case you want to go for a Calm Mind. Let's see. And Majagacha. Oh lord, please no burn. Okay, no burn, so we good. So let's knock it off. Probably gonna knock off its item. Most likely they're going to Terra since it relies on Terra Steel, like I thought. And it does some damage. So it just strengths that, fully heals. But we did lose his weakness policy, which is really, really good. So let's continue on. Let's push on. Let's see. And go for a calm mine. Let's go for you know what? Let's go for let's go for another U-turn and try to cook. Boom. And we go iron treads. So they lost out on their potential ghost site, but let's see. Okay, no burn. Alright, so we can probably Earthquake this, and 
The only other mods that could really tank a hit like this are Cresselia, Enamorous, and most likely Masquerada, if it wants. So this is really, really nice. And if uh, Enamorous is not a... Most of his Pokemon are... N most of their Pokemon are not really Strength Sap. Okay. Yo, know what? I'm a Rapid Spin. It's not worth trying to take any more Hazard Chip. And I'm probably going to lose my attack some more just because of this uh, Sinus Child. So we remove that. And basically, like I thought, we get that. So probably Magic Gotcha and Shadow Ball, more likely. And let's Encore it. And make sure it loses its stat boost. Let's go Aurorville on the main. Let's see. Hmm. Do that. And let's go to the Titan. Let's call mine. I'm gonna go start some chaos. And let's go belly drum. Boom. There we go. And I don't think it has a fire move. Yep, nope. And I think that's it. Let me see. You know what? Let's go liquidation and kill it. Oh. Oh no. But it's bulky. Ayo. Hey, it's bulk is enough to take on that. No, it's it's Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh my god, I think we probably got another sweep on our hands. Let's let's see. Okay. Oh my god, we might have another sweep. This mon, if you're not careful, really cleans up games. And I really do think it's a funny thing that does that. And another forfeit! How am I keep winning with these the Titan teams? This I've been testing it a little bit, and it's like, you know. My bad. Yeah. Well, how in the hell did uh, I literally raise my rating and stuff? But yeah, that's a. Uh, I'm raising up the ladder really good, but it's like, hey yo, how am I doing this with uh 1331 on the UU ladder? Hey yo, let's move on. So yeah, it looks like we're playing against that, and we're playing off against a uh, Star Raptor team. So let's. There's probably gonna be a Star Raptor suicide. I'm guessing Final Gambit. No. Probably gonna be a reckless team, more likely. Okay. Probably gonna be Brave Bird, right? Yeah, I knew this was something funny like that would happen. I think I'm faster, but let's go. Yep, there you go. Oh, I forgot. High Dragon speeds. I would have out gotten outspeed with a scarf. But, okay. Let's do something completely funny. Let's do it again. A a th fourth time and we just do that bring double edge into the mix and boom and that's how we start chains do this and let's go liquidation and vacuum we does absolutely nothing and I don't know how can this Pokemon be so dominant in a in something like this but yet be so low in the tier. I mean, I really do appreciate the the level that the Titan's on. But, like, I understand it's inconsistent. But something like this is completely outlandish. And look at that. I'm cleaving through the entire team. This is the third game in a row that I did this. I'm struggling with it in testing, but... I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. This... This is completely funny. I, I I cannot believe that I'm cleaving through the entire UU ladder right now with this entire thing. I thought it was gonna be you know simple, easy, you know, fun, but Oh lord. They're probably gonna forfeit or whatever or stall for time. I wonder if they lost I wonder if they left. Or something happened with the crappy internet connection where I'm at right now. Let's see. Hmm. Guessing. Well, they didn't tear it yet. Oh, no, they tear water. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, that's what I was realizing. It's probably my crappy internet, not the. Oh, no, they left, so. Kind of a thing. But, yeah. Yeah, GG's. yeah this was unfortunate. Yeah, this was unfortunate. Yeah, GG's. And look at that right here. It was a sportsman-like conduct. Yeah. Let's, 
It looks like to be more of a bulky core today, it seems like. Oh yeah, here we go. This is this is our next game. Of course, we have a bulkier core to run around with. Let's see. Room wash. You know what? Let's go Hydragon on the uh, Draco. There's no switch ins rather than Scizor. If he wants to take a bulky hit. Yep. And there you go. Trick. And he realizes crap. He's Choice Scarf too. So, yeah. You know what's funny? They tricked. We got tricked and we can still use another move. So, this is funny. We're faster and can use a free move. And you go to Scizor. This is absolutely funny. This is comical. These type of themes would definitely struggle, but this is comical. We're like, oh yeah, this is this is funny. But yeah, since uh, Rod Rodom is obviously Scarf, I could definitely go for Stealth Rock and definitely try to kill it off. Let's go for Earthquake. It's no potential hazard control. It has hazard control, but what I'm saying is it has no potential, you know, has no way of truly killing off, you know, his, their the potential threats. Like I know Moltres is one of their big threats they have. Let's go. Uh, let's go back to let's go back to Hydragon just in case they don't want to go for a fire move. And you go for a U-turn, which is understandable. They're probably gonna go Scizor. Most likely, they'll either Bullet Punch or Defog. So I'm gonna get run run their options thin, and I'm gonna go Flamethrower. Like I said, this was an option to throw in thin. Let's see. And more likely they'll bring out Umbreon. Probably to make a toxic stall happen. More likely. But yeah, there we go. I'm just Earthquake. And there's some damage right there. Foul plays there. We do lose the... We do lose that. But let's try out Thunderous. Thunderous might do a little bit of work, but... Let's see, this team is really weak to Thunderous. And we do predict the Protect, so this is funny. We do predict the Protect, and we, no, we don't cleave it, but we paralyze it. And we're immune to, oh my god, this is fun. Yeah, we do get the Toxic Stall, no Predict. But let's go for, no, I was like, oh man, I thought about that, but yeah, there is, there's funny. You go Rotom Wash, that's instant kill, and no poison. So, that goes the moot. The next, yep, you go to Breloom, guess your next best option. So, I'm going to bring out a... Wow. That kills. And if you're not, I know you're going to be Ice Shard, but let me Grass Knot. Good point. Good point. And Trailblaze 2, that does not kill, but the Toxic does kill me. So, you're 284, I am about 220-something. But, um, you're probably going to be, you're probably going to hate this, but let me go back to Ninetales once again. You're probably going to go Trailblaze, aren't you? Earthquake, okay. Perfect. Do that, and I'm going to Encore you. No, you're probably a... This is a loaded dice set, it seems like. I'm gonna go do this, because it's a moot point that you're trying to do on me. There you go. Ice School Spear, Earthquake. Earthquake, okay. Moot point, but I win. Yeah, this this is definitely a game changer, right here. You see right here, after I decide to go for the Ninetales, you know, I'm like, you know what? I mean, I did clean up most of his team with Iron Shreds and Hydragon and Thunderous. But you know what? There's only one way to do this, and I'm gonna cleave through the rest of his team with the Titan, and I tried doing that, and basically he, he knew the game was over, so I did that. But yeah, let's move on to our one of our I say this will be our next game at least. <clears throat> yeah. So this is a Sinistra Ogre Pond. This is probably more of a def more balanced core. So let's try to start off with the. Let's go ahead, Dragon again for the lead. So scout some some sets. Okay, you're probably going to be U-turn, Scarf U-turn, either Scarf, either Scarf U-turn, or you're going to be Bullet Punch. And there we go, moot point. 
and go that, we go flamethrower. And since there's no status, you try to go for that. And you have the special defense boost. I'm gonna swap out. I'm gonna go nine tails just in case you want to go for a aqua step. Bulk up. Let's go encore because you're not gonna be faster. I'm gonna go Aurora Veil. And then I'm gonna go freeze dry. Boom. I'm going to Encore again. You want to go Scizor. I'm going to go... I'm going to go to Thunderous. Oh, no, no, no. You're probably going to go Bullet Punch me. I'm probably going to go Hydreigon. You're, it's Fire. I definitely have a better shot with this over the other threats. And it definitely does get hurt. There you go. U-Turn is definitely there. I think they'll probably go back to Quaquavel. Yep. And since it did hit the wheezing, they probably think it's whatever. I'm gonna go Draco since I'm faster. Like I'm speed type, but I'm definitely am faster. But I'm guessing they're probably either I'm speed tied or I'm definitely scarf. So I'm gonna go for a. Uh, let's go Iron Treads. Let's see if we can try to see for a uh, Stealth Rock, of course. I'm going to go Earthquake just in case. I mean, the only... I mean, yeah, Sinishaw is definitely understandable. Probably predicting the Rapid Spin. I'm going to go Iron Head just in case you want to go for another move, right? And Maja Gacha. Am I going to get burnt? Hopefully not. Nope. So I'm a Stealth Rock. This be the best option. And there we go. No burn. So we we're perfect. So I'm going to go back to Nine Tails. You're probably going to go Calm Mind, most likely, right? Shadow Ball. I'm going to go Roar Veil. You're probably going to go for Calm Mind. That's your next move, right? All right. Nope. And I'm going to Freeze Dry to sack off the Nine Tails so I can get a potential Sight and cleanup game. Let's see if that can definitely work. There we go. And let's see. We have this attack. Oh, I forgot. I tear it on the Hydragon. No! And it's still moot point. Let's see, let's see. Let's see if we can do liquidation. It feels like a moot point. The deep Oh, it is not a moot point. It's not a moot point, I tell you that one. Yeah, that definitely was a waste of time, but yeah. Terra is definitely needed on that, I tell you. Terra does not heal the wounds. Yeah, there you go, Weezing Galar. It's flamethrower. And I'm guessing they're probably Terra on this Titan. Go Treads in case they want to go Bolt Switch. More likely, if you're the. There you go. And I'm going to go Iron Head in case they want to go Sinish Shot. There we go. To prevent a Rapid Spin going on. I'm going to go Thunderous in case I want to go for a Strength Set. Infected. And now we have three moves revealed. So I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go nasty plot. I'm gonna go grass knot now, since I'm definitely speed tied, but also I'm immune to basically their moves, and they're gonna spike up. Perfect. This is perfect. So I have the ogre pond left. I have the magic gacha one. Sure, uh, since shot I get walled by, but this is better off than trying to potentially beat out. So yep, like I said, I get walled out, but I definitely have a thing. There we go, and it, it tries to attack. But Thunderous is taking over the last, you know, the second to last game. I'm actually really surprised that, you know, this team works so well together. So they're probably either going to go Scizor for the potential Technician band or whatever, or Ogre Pond for the potential speed. Which Ogre Pond I see, they're probably going to go Knockoff, or they're probably going to go Ivy Cudgel. That's my best point. Or they're going to go Swords Dance and potentially lose the game. Surprising. So they thought that and basically we won the game. So let's move on to our last game. We're back and it seems like we got Rain on the field. And let's see if our Reign of Chaos will finally end against Mega Ooze. Let's see if it finally ends. You know what? They bring in Pelipper? I got an idea. No, let's let's bring a safe pick. 
Mm. What type of pick should we do? We're probably going to go for Iron Treads or Sandy Shocks or... Either, most likely their leads would be either Caliper or Sandy Shocks. I'm probably going to go for bringing that. Nine Tails would definitely be a perfect lead. And if they do go to Rotom, it's more unconventional. If they want to trick it out, then I could go to Hydreigon and definitely get some new moves off. Let's go Nine Tails Alola. Oh shoot! Is the crappy internet back again? Oh no! Or is it me overthinking about the potential opponent? Oh yeah, I definitely knew that was going to be bad. But I'm back. Wait, let's go freeze dry. Okay. I don't know how the hell did I, did I realize we got the crappy internet. I was scared for a moment, but how did I predict the entire Pelipper lead? And I thought they're not going to switch. This is relatively simple, I guess. But uh, this is this is really good. Oh no. Oh no! Please don't forfeit. It ain't over. I'm not going to throw the game, but I'm going to see how entertaining it will be. Let's see. You're going to go Terra Water and Liquidation. Yep. I'm going to go Draco Meteor because I know you're probably going to do that in Liquidation again. I'm going to go Nine Tails for the final move. And I think that's over. You're probably going to go for another Liquidation because it's uh, not no longer Rain Boosted. But... Let me go Roar Veil now. You're probably going to go Stealth Rock. But it went from a really easy game for him after the Stealth Rock and stuff. But yeah. We definitely go back to... Let's go to Titan. We do have the potential defense, HP and everything. And Earthquake. Oh no. Oh no, this is bad. You know what? I'm going to go Liquidation. It's not worth it. And what a smart play on my part. I'm gonna go back to Nine Tails in case they want to go Wisp. Okay, I'm gonna go Choice Specs. That's fine by me. I mean, I can go Freeze Draw and completely, you know, beat out your team. I could definitely do that and try my best to beat out your other team and your teammates. I mean, it's not a good point. I'm fishing for Freeze, which is something I love doing in in other in a gen one it's definitely not a good point to definitely start off with and we and it lost its rocker so this is really nice you know what yeah i'm gonna sack it off you're probably gonna flip turn and the f only problem i have is barracuda is so fast that uh you know that's the problem it is fast. So let's do that. And you're probably going to bring out Sandy Shocks. Which is walled or either has rocks or whatever. So most likely Sandy Shocks is walled by Tornadus. Or no, not Tornadus. Thunderous. And we do kill it. So this is great. So we do wall the... We do wall that. But uh... They'll probably have a water move. I'm not really af I'm afraid to doing. But I'm going to swap this to Titan just in case I want to go for a water move like that. And then go close combat, which is perfect. Which means, you know, the locked into close combat, I could definitely go for a nasty plot and do some damage. And I'm going to go Grass Knot because you're definitely trying to use Choice Spec. You did Choice Specs and you swapped it out. So you do lose out in your damage output. And I did... Oh, okay. I forgot it's light. I think this probably kills off the rest of Rotom. Yep. And Barracuda definitely cleans up, right? So yeah, I'm probably going to go for... If they go... Uh, I'm probably going to go Treads to sack off and try to finish off the... You know, get Barracuda to finish off the Treads. If, uh, if they play smartly and go for the flip turn that's ggs if not then this is still a game gonna go on i did have a few misplays in the last game but i really do think that you know this is gonna be something fun 
This is what I've been looking for. All game I'm getting all all this time I'm getting sweep after sweep after sweep after sweep. And I'm like, when is it gonna start? You know. Oh wait, this is a mistake. Hurricane. Oh no, wait. Yeah, oh no. I'm gonna just probably go rapid spin a few times and try to see what happens. It's probably gonna be a moot point, but okay. Hold on. This isn't a moot point. I think I just won the game. I think I just won the damn game. Oh my god. I don't know how I did it, but I think I just won the game. Let's go Iron Head. Oh my Oh my god, I just won the game like that. Hey yo. But yeah. But yeah. After all this type of stuff, man. Make sure you like and subscribe for the videos and all that stuff. I mean, make and follow for more content like this. Hey, yo, this is something. Uh, you know, I thought I, I thought I was lost in this game, and basically making a few smart plays like that, I really do enjoy. This uh, type of Titan team, I really do enjoy, and even though they try going for trick and all that stuff and predicting Willowis, but this is really fun. It's a Titan. Who knew you were good in Yu Yu? You were good. Who knew you were good in Yu Yu with along with Nine Tails? This is like a it was with Nine Tails with Bax Caliber Junior. But yeah, I think next time we'll probably you know go move on to a new pasture, new frontier, and try to go for another uh, another set, another not another set, but we're trying to go for another uh, meta game and try to see if we can try to cleave through that. But yeah. Rather than all my rambling on, all my waffling, see you on the next one. Bandito out! Ooh.